Is everything turned on? Yeah. It worked today, huh? Well, hi. I had to delete everything and then redo it again. But it only took one turning off of the TV. Yeah, that took me longer to set away from up. Yeah. Hello, Americans. Hey, guys. Hello, Americans. Hey, guys. Welcome back to the channel, friends. If you're new here, I'm Dan. I'm Emily. We're American Acres, full-time RVers that love to watch movies. So today we have got Halloween. Rob, Rob Zombies. Zombies Halloween, Halloween. The unrated director's cut. Yes. Now this we've seen a long once, time ago. Once a long time ago. And I don't remember. I don't remember a lot of the details. I yeah. couldn't tell you the actress that played Jamie Lee Curtis's part. What I can tell you I is don't... I remember getting... I think more of him killing, more of this killing the sister story in the beginning. More of him as a kid, yes. As a kid. But I remember as a man, he was absolutely enormous. Why are they carrying him? He's walking. Yeah. Uh, had a hobby of making masks. Right. And the kid is, I just remember from being in Hancock. My papa says you're in that cell. Right. But I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, even you saying all the masks and stuff, I forgot about that. Yeah, it was like a, a, a hobby, I guess. Yeah, like paper mache Yeah, like paper mache masks. In the asylum that he was in. So he wasn't doing it as a kid? I don't remember if he did it as a I kid or not. Or it was like a way to not have to deal with the world or talk to people or right. something. But I remember just thinking it was so excellent done. Uh, yeah, I remember really liking it, but I don't remember the details of it. And we haven't seen the second one. Right. Which, which is why is we're rewatching this one. Correct. Absolutely. So it's more I'm of a very rewatch. I'm excited, excited for the second one. Technically, it's a rewatch, but I don't know how much I'll remember. Right. And hey, I'm totally happy to watch it again. Yeah, this is absolutely you know? one I would watch again. Yeah. I'm looking forward to the second one. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm ready to go. Let's watch a movie then. God, God. The baddest Chicano in the barrio. No, that ain't me. Not anymore. Ever since the kid died, man. Yeah. That's a weak ass bullshit, you. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Got my security blanket, even though it's hot as heck out here. I brought my guns. <laughs> All right, play. Darkest souls are not those which choose to exist. Yeah. Doctor Loomis. That's his doctor. Yeah. Right? Field, Illinois, October 31st. I hope she likes cripples. I will crawl over there and I will scum out of you. Well, this will be easy to edit. Right? Oh. All right, I'll clean it up. <laughs> Dang. Get your ass downstairs and wash your hands, you little shit. I'm not listening. Tell you something, that freak of yours, he needs some serious discipline. I mean, he runs around like a little bitch. I hate you. And I hate you too, you see this? As soon as this heals, I'm gonna break it again on your face. I'm yeah, it's so angry. Hey, Mikey, how's your mom doing? You know, my old man said that for a buck, she'd rub on his face. Shut up. Yeah, good luck at it then. Right? Hey, tough guy. Shut up! Shut up! Has your son ever had any kind of serious psychiatric evaluation? Okay. He's super young here, too. What do you mean, problem? He's a very disturbed young man. I have a great choice to put the music over that. 
Alright, we're graduating. Yup. Damn, he came out of nowhere. I thought he might have been behind him. Yeah. Like stalking him. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's like a disconnect. Yeah. I think. Yeah. That's terrifying. While they're talking to his mother. Yeah. Judith, I'm gonna be late! Judith, I'm gonna be late! Yeah, he's just mean to be me. Yeah, what has she got this dude around for? Disability checks? Yeah. What about trick-or-treating? Are you kidding me? Go by yourself. Aren't you too old for that anyway? I wonder if that's the first mask he had to go with his clown costume. Uh, Great music. You knew, you know it's gonna be good. Yeah, you know Zombie's gonna get that part right. Yeah. That so looks like the original house, too. You have to eat candy corn. If you eat candy corn, you have to eat it layer by layer. Oh, but I can only handle like three pieces. Right. I'm kind of over it. Yeah. And they sell it to you in a one pound bag. And like, any, you know, that would last me a lifetime. Is he still asleep? Probably am. Oh, yeah. Yep, there we go. Like Randy Santel turning his hat around. <laughs> Time for business. <laughs> the next song that comes into my head. How do you like me now? Make the sandwich. Not at that. Oh, he's gonna try everything. He's gotta figure out what yeah. he likes. <gasps> oh! Seeds. There you go. All the music. Answer me. I think any man with the women in his life was, was doomed. Yeah. Even if it wasn't been a good dude. Yeah. Eleven months later. What do you remember about that night, Halloween? Remember nothing about getting a knife. Mm -mm. I didn't oh, do that. So lying. Is everyone at home okay? I would like to know why they're not being real with them. I think they might actually believe he doesn't remember, but the original painted the character to be extremely intelligent. He wasn't right. mentally handicapped by any means. Oh, Machete, you're screwed. Hey, Mikey. <laughs> How you doing? Why did you make it? I have my secrets. Ah, wait a minute. Michael has begun to obsess on the construction of these primitive masks. I'm here to help you. I feel an utter failure at the moment. The child christened Michael Myers has become a, a sort of ghost, a mere shape of a human being. I love seeing this side of it too. The development. Um, yeah, I don't remember the doctor being so useless. I mean, right? he really is telling him nothing. It's like you're waiting for the kid to come up with all the 
the info of what he means. There's no idea what he means. He's just been harassing. Well, I guess I'll see you next week. I won't hit the car. We really may want to consider maybe shock treatment. <laughs> I love that we only hear the siren. With all the screams and everything. Yeah, the directorial choices are fantastic. Come she on. failed the first two kids. Wow. Time to go. Can we not call people names? Sorry about these chains, Mikey. <laughs> That's a monster over here. You got feelings for this big idiot? He's Fuck, man. still a person. You know what? I've been taking care of this Hit. kid for almost 20 years. And me and him... So, I'm sorry to tell you that this is going to be my last day. Yeah, I mean, I wonder how long he's going to be in this facility. I'm surprised they let him keep working on the kid. Yeah. 20 years? It was useless from what I saw. Take care, Mike. Mikey, 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 Mikey. Oh, my. <laughs> Who is hiring these people? Right? Let's do it, Michael. Let's go. Let's go. With no effort. Yeah, that's a monster of a man. Oh! He's been your friend. I wasn't prepared for how violent this movie's getting. I should have been, but I wasn't. Oh, shit. Nice. Yeah, it's an hour into this movie, and we're just getting to Lori. We ever get the name of the baby? No, he only called her Boo. Well. That's just ridiculous. Wow. And hid the knife. Wow. That's cool. It just speaks to his intelligence to know ahead of time, I'm going to jail and I'm going to hide this shit, come back and get it whenever. You know, like I wonder if Lori's the oh, no, baby. Tommy. Yeah, I I don't know. That's kind of I think that's what I thought in the last movie, but I wasn't sure. Because you know the kid ended up in the system, probably adopted. Yeah. Isn't going to be told anything about her background. If it was a girl, I don't even know that. I think it was. Because she could be the sister of the girl from the beginning. Right. They look a lot alike. They do. Yeah, I'm totally famous. <laughs> yeah, I can hear him snoring. Is he snoring? I hear that through my headphones. Yeah. <laughs> there he is. He's back there. Aw, how cute. Please help me with this. Look at that van. It really sucks that they're selling this place. Dude, we'll find another house to party in. They're partying in his house? I would not party in a house like this. Yeah. 
I think he's, ooh, he was right there. He's got to get it. It's just funny to be worried about that. Oh, that scared the poop out of me. That's a strong knife. And wall. And very gross. <laughs> Can you not tell that that person is so much bigger? Right. 22 Smith and Wesson. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's, yeah. mm -hmm. 22. That's okay if you want to just piss it off. Right? Blow its fucking head off. This is yeah, we're going to need that one. 357 oh. Magnum. Yeah. Doing okay? Yeah, my hands hurt. Yeah. Oh, damn. Man, he just gets up on people quick. Yeah, he does. Man, it's his hands as big as her head. Oh, that's so creepy. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That that is enormous. He's right behind her. Watching that same show. Us. It's Halloween Doc, night. It sounds if to me like you're talking yeah. about the Antichrist. Well, perhaps I am. Why is not my girlfriend? <laughs> I hate girls. Why doesn't anyone understand this? <laughs> well, he's okay. I mean, you need a boyfriend. <laughs> Annie, I don't need a boyfriend. See, I never acted like this with my girlfriends in high school. Yeah, maybe you just don't remember. <laughs> you have to stop thinking. That we're dealing with a normal man here. We he's back there, he's back there, he's back there. Oh it totally feels like the 2000s. It does. You know. The rug burn. <laughs> About 17 years ago, I respond to a 911. And I see this beautiful, innocent baby sitting in this little bloody mess. I admit her from the report. I drive her to another town. About three months later, I find out from a friend of mine, Mason Strode, that he's adopted. Yep. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh my god, is he behind the door? Uh-huh. Oh my god! Oh my god! My name's Lori Strode. I'm at one night at 7 with Desert Dime. Two stabbing victim call placed by a Lori Strode. He's found us! How long is it going to take to get there? It's about 10 minutes. Well, shit, 10 minutes. This thing will be over in two minutes. Get on it. Oh, the music. And he just walks behind her. Jesus. Oh. Oh no, that's not the where the call house. came from. Yeah, she called 911 from the other house. They're not going to show up at the right address. They don't know she's across the street. No, this is the house that she's at, though. Yeah. All right. He's that's... out there, please. Oh, well, that was lucky. Don't open the door. Don't. Oh. That was pretty wicked. You're a horrible shot. Did you shoot him? In the shoulder. Oh, okay. You gotta get off more than one shot. Yeah. 
He only wants Lori. Oh, they're going to the right address. So why did the cops show up to the other house? Yeah, and I'm sure she doesn't know anything about her past. No, she doesn't know who she is. Yeah, I mean, her family doesn't even know. I just don't understand. Oh my god, it's so scary. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Oh god! <laughs> he is coming through the wall. She's got a good scream. Man, that scream. Oh. Bless you, man. Man, we're doing that shit behind me. Ah, damn. I failed you. Please, let her go. Please. I thought we were done. <laughs> yep. Oh, okay, so this is recreating the closet scene. Oh. Oh, the doctor's dead. Bummer. That's a bummer. I'd be a wreck. How many shots does she have left? Two. Three if it was fully loaded. Yeah. But that's a big gun. It might jump right out of her hand if she pulls her through Oh, he is terrifying. Yeah, that's a great update on the mask. Yeah. It's like whack-a-mole. Right? <laughs> Hey. Oh god, get off of him. Get off of him, get off of him. Get off of him. <laughs> it has taken so long for the police to show up. <laughs> Well, and that's something we need to, I want to look at later. Uh, Keep going, the cylinder may have turned. Remember he said he drove the baby to the next town over. And that's where all that shit happened, was at the adopted house. Right. So Michael would have had to have carried her back to the original town. Which is where they're at. Jeez. Nice. Right? Wait, we have... So he carried her all the way back to the original town. Yeah. Which, which why it took the been... cops so long to get there. Yeah. Ew. So creepy. Yeah. Halloween. Yeah, that was good. That was great. That was good. It was a little juvenile in the writing, I think. Yeah, the, just the girls together the got to be a little much. Right. But, but maybe that's what Rob Zombie thinks teenage girls talk like. You. Right. But man, all of the backstory on Michael was fantastic. I would even like... You know, I don't know. I have no idea what the second Halloween is about. No idea. But I would love more information on Michael in the the uh, asylum that he was in. 
yeah. you know, his like day to day life and, you know, just what the kind of treatment they were trying to do with him was. And I would be really interested to see, you know, more stuff like that. I'm talking about him like he's a real person. <laughs> but yeah, you know, the only other thing in the writing was, you know, she called the cops from the little girl's house. But they showed up at Tommy's house, the little boy that she worked with. Sure, sure. So, and then I don't know why those cops showed up at that house. Maybe they heard the screams or something. I don't know. Maybe someone else. Oh, and I don't know complaint. which house was which address. Right. She may have been at the stabbing house and given him the address of where she was babysitting. Yeah, but then the. The sheriff, Annie's dad, and the doctor showed up at the house that Annie was in. Oh, yeah, that's true. You know, so that was a little... And it would have come up on the 911. Yeah. System. Because... Yeah, especially with home phones. So I am a little curious on how the cops figured out to go across the street. Right. I don't know if we missed something there. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, and I can never her, look that. Carrying her all the way back across... Because he didn't say he took her across town. He said he took her to the next town over. Right. That's com two completely different things. Yeah, but you never know where she got adopted from. Like, you know, back to. Because they went to, she, like, the two girls went to Haddonfield High School. So it was the same, like, town, you know, that Michael was in. You know? Yeah. But. Sort of friend, I guess. Adopted her and came back with her. Yeah. To the same kind of area. You know. That's a little confusing. Yeah. And but, I would have liked more in the asylum to yeah. kind of pinpoint how he knew who he was looking for. Right. How he knew, you know, did he overhear things? There's no any nothing of them going and telling him his mother's dead. Right. So some of that Maybe to play into his intelligence yeah. would have been good. I mean, it was a two-hour movie, but it could have been two and a half, three hours, and I would have sat here jaw dropped, you know, engaged the whole time. Yeah, it was excellent. Yeah. Done. You know, there's going to be hiccups, I guess, but it was it was well done. Yeah. The music was great. Yeah, the directorial choices of when to play the music and then the shot selection and all of that was awesome. Yeah. The guy was enormous, and I th oh think he's a rest. He might be. Wasn't it like the big show or one of these enormous fucking WWE guys? Yeah. That played that role? I don't mean. We'll have to go. Yeah, it. I don't know. That was good. That was good. I, yeah. I'm ready for the Sunday. Right. I definitely want to see this. And I did not remember much of any of it, you know? No. I didn't remember him bringing her back into the house after we thought she was all safe and sound you know i didn't remember the doctor still being alive and you know the pool and all that like that was very well done you know the the kind of homage that they yeah they had did, just enough nods yeah to the original yeah the callbacks and the nods and everything you know without changing them. right yeah i liked it it's just updated. Yeah. It's great. It was really good. Yeah. Really good. Recommend. Recommend. Definitely recommend. Two thumbs up. Spooky season. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But. All right. That's all I got. If you guys want to support, share it. Check all the links below. Yeah, Buy a appreciate shirt. you guys. Buy a coffee. Yes. Or just subscribe. Yeah. Because I want to say. When I was looking at our analytics, we've got about 15,000 people that watch our channel and only about 1,500 that are actually subscribed. Subscribe? Which is normal. Horrible numbers. Wow. Right. Oh, it's like 10%. Yeah. Subscribe. So, yeah. Subscribe and share. That helps a huge amount. It really does. Thanks for being here with us, guys. We'll see you next time for Halloween Part 2. Thanks, guys.